A Taiwan company has unveiled a next-generation smart device that takes aim at the post-pandemic stay-at-home market. It's a voice-controlled home assistant that can screen for fevers, play movies and even serve as a security guard. Let's see it in action. This AI butler can distinguish between family and friends. If it detects a stranger breaking into your room, it will automatically send a text message to your phone. After this AI butler detects a person entering a room, it will ask the person for a password. If the person can provide the correct password within 10 seconds, an alarm will ring and a text alert will be sent to the registered homeowner. Once you're in the home, you can have the device capture your image and add it, then enter yourself into the system using a mobile app. That way, you'll be recognized as a family member. It will recognize you and use its AI logic to offer services. If there's someone it doesn't recognize, it will notify you through your phone, no matter where you are. This AI butler can also complete a thermal temperature screening in 0.5 seconds using a system developed in collaboration with the National Health Research Institute. We partnered with the National Health Research Institutes. You only need to install a small thermal imaging lens. After installing it, you'll have what you see here. Every person in the frame will have a temperature reading. If the temperature is too high, it will send out an alarm. You can ask the device questions, which it will answer using Google's artificial intelligence. You can watch news, check the weather, and control smart home devices. You can also access video streaming services on its 8-inch high-resolution touchscreen. We put a lot of thought into home entertainment. We integrated OTT streaming into the robot, integrating AI services and smart functions from voice commands to facial recognition. It's all integrated. You tell the device, I want to watch cable TV, and it will turn into a TV. If you ask about the weather today, it becomes the Internet. With regard to the voice recognition, we've created a very intelligent recognition system that allows the device to switch functions, going from a TV to a robot. Taking aim at workers in the post-COVID economy, companies like these are looking for innovative ways to cater to the stay-at-home market. For most of news, Stephanie Yang, Zhang Tingxiang in Taipei.